Hey guys, so recently I made this remake of Russian Bag by Flume and first of all I want to say thank you for all the positive feedback. I'm really glad you enjoyed it. And many of you guys wanted me to break it down, so here I am. And one thing before we get started, make sure to subscribe to my channel. It would really help me in the channel out. And follow my Instagram. I'm posting previews to upcoming videos and show you snippets of my life. So follow rise.music. And now, without further ado, Here's the breakdown. Now I started this project with this toy piano sound and I did that with Serum. Here is how I made the Serum patch and it's basically just sine waves. And if you listen closely I added this noise on top of it with really short attack and decay so it has this real piano pressing feeling. Then I used this plugin RC20 to make it sound a little old, to add distortion and to add a little reverb. And that's it for the toy piano sound. Now I didn't have to do that, but I just duplicated the serum patch and only played the bass line. Then I made this very simple super saw in serum and here's how I made it. Simple, right? Now everything together. Now let's move on to the drums of the drop. Now what I noticed is that Flume layered some of his kicks with an explosion sound and that really made a huge difference. Otherwise there's nothing really special about the drums, just like the Median track I just added a drum bus. Listen on how much impact the explosion sound has. It just make it sound so huge. For the chords I made this saw patch in Serum and it just has a long attack and that was basically it. Otherwise it's just the same saw preset like in the beginning. Now for the vocal chops I found this sample on a sample pack. and I just put it on a sampler and played around with the MIDI. Now before I move on, I saw some guys on Reddit asking me why I didn't use a granulator. Well I know Flume is known for the granulator, but you don't always have to use the same plugins like the other artists to make it sound similar. Now for example the toy sound. Apparently Flume used Faceplant for it and I just happened to make it on Serum. And it sounds similar, at least in my opinion. And there was this one guy who basically said you should have used the granulator, then it would sound more to the original. And no, it wouldn't. First you have to have the same sample that Flume used. And second, you just have more control with MIDI. Now I'm not saying it wouldn't work on a granulator, but I just happened to do it on a sampler and I think it sounds pretty close. <coughs> Sorry for the little rant. Now let's continue. Now after playing around with the vocal sample a bit, this is what I got. Now after some distortion, reverb and EQ, it sounds like this. Now I 
Now many of you guys asked me for the flute sound that I used on a drop and it's basically just analog lab. I used this preset and tweaked it a bit and added some effects. Add an 808 on top of it and you're done with the drop. And that was it for the breakdown. I hope you enjoyed the video, if you want to see more subscribe to my channel and if you have any idea on what I should do next, leave them in the comments below. It could be anything from video ideas to remakes I should do next. Now I hope I could help you a little bit and see you in the next one.